guys, Songpum112 here, and in this episode, we're gonna go take on the Blackthorn Gym. Now, this is the Gym of Dragons, but first I gotta battle all the trainers and whatnot, so I'm just gonna do that really fast, and I'll be um, right back. So, speed it up! Alright guys, um, I'm here to do the boulder puzzle. This one is actually a, um, like, trick one. This one you don't have to do at all, but just for the heck of it, I'll show it to you guys. Boulder fell through, yeah. Okay, so if you go down here, then it's there, which doesn't do anything for you. So, that one's just like a fake one. Um, the one that you actually want to do, the two that you actually want to do, you have to do two, is you want to push this one down, And then come over here. And it's so nice that there's no random encounters while you're doing this. That, that always annoyed the crap out of me. Push it all the way up. Push it to the right. Bam. There we go. I can actually get away from it. Nice. And then for this one, just push this one all the way to the right. And then down. And I get another step away. Nice. So, um... I guess I'll just speed through this one. This battle really fast. Um, actually, depending on how many street Pokemon she has, I might commentate it. But we'll see. Maybe she's as good as Claire. Alright. Here we are. In front of Claire. So, um, let's do this. I am Claire. I am the world's best Dragon Master. I can hold my own even against the Pokemon Elite League's Elite Four. Do you still want to take me on? Fine. Let's do it. As a trainer, I will use my full power against my opponent. That didn't sound slightly weird. And here is leader Claire. She will start off with a Dragonair. Actually, that's really all she has. She's got three Dragonairs. Um, and the only difference in them is their movesets. I'm gonna just start off with Lapras and use Ice Beam. So her first Dragonair has the moves Thunder Wave, Surf, Slam, and Dragon Breath. So... It's not something to mess around with, especially if you don't have Lapras. And if you didn't pick up Lapras, um, definitely go to the Ice Cave and pick up uh, Piloswine or Jinx. I, I'd, I'd suggest Jinx, personally. But um, here's her second Dragonair. And I can't tell which one this is. I can't tell. I'll, let's just assume it's the one with that has Thunder Wave, Thunderbolt, Slam, and Dragon Breath. They're all the same, except for their second move. And since Lapras is one hit KOing them, I can't actually, like, go into their movesets to, like, tell. Yeah, if that was her second Pokemon, then that was the one that had, um, Thunderbolt. Then, next up, she'll throw out her next Dragonair, which has the moves Thunder Wave, Ice Beam, Slam, and Dragon Breath. So that's another one no-brainer. And then, um, next up, well, I'll wait for this Dragonair to die. Alright, so this is really short, I'm not gonna lie. I'm sorry that it's not longer and that I can't drag out the battle, but I think we'd all prefer me to just win. So, here comes Kingdra. For those of you who don't know, Kingdra is the evolutionary form of Seedra when you trade it with the Dragon Scale. Um, so, to start, I'm just gonna use Thunder Punch. Oh, and Kingdra has the moves Smoke Screen, Surf, Hyper Beam, and Dragon Breath. So they... Yes, that's what I wanted to see. I wanted to see some paralysis. Nice job, Amphi. So Amphi will grow to level 38. My hope is that before we go to the Elite 4, everyone will be level 4. Oh, man, Hyper Potion. At least it wasn't a full restore. Yeah, we're going to be seeing a lot of those soon. But, um, yeah. I'd suggest that if you guys are at the Elite 4 already, definitely go with, like, level 40s. Like, ranging. Like, it's too bad that Lapras is the highest level Pokemon on my team because we're going to be at Victory Road. And that's, like, full of rock types. 
So, full, full of Pokemon that are weak to those kinds of moves. And that's amazing. We've already defeated Claire. I don't believe it. There must be some mistake. And we got 4,000 Poke Dollars for winning. I won't admit this. I may have lost, but you're still not ready for the Pokemon League. I know. You should take the Dragon User Challenge. Find this gym is a place called Dragon's Den. Go and bring me the Dragon Fang from deep inside the den. That is the test to be accepted as the true Dragon User. If you can do that, I will accept you as a worthy trainer. Until then, I won't give you a badge. Are you kidding me? I just... I destroyed you. Like, the only Pokemon that was actually a challenge for me was your Kingdra. Your Dragoneers were useless and worthless. Anyway, I suggest you get an escape room. I'm gonna do so right now. Before we hit the dragons then. And I'm gonna go grab Heracross. So I'm gonna cut. Be right back. Alright guys, so I'm in front. I had to go... Well, one. I had to go pick up Staryu because you need Whirlpool to venture into this place and get the dragon scale. And also, I picked up um, an escape rope because you can't buy one there. So I went to Violet City. Um, so yeah, come down these stairs. And you hear this... Music that actually aggravates the crap out of me. Um, there are no trainers in here, unlike in the remix, which is nice and annoying at the same time because I would like more people to battle against. But um, um, as for Pokemon that you can find in the water, you can find Dragonair, Dratini, and Magikarp, and I'm pretty sure that's it. Um, I would probably check another source just to be safe. But um, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's all you can find. And I'm pretty sure Dragonair like five percent of the time. So that place has some meaning in Crystal and the remix. So um, yeah. So just come up here, and bam, you get the Dragon Fang. Did I say Dragon Scale earlier? I, de I meant to say Dragon Fang, excuse me. And Claire comes to greet you. Alright, I recognize your true power. This badge is yours. And you get the Rising Badge! Rising Badge will enable your Pokemon to use the move for climbing waterfalls. Also, all Pokemon will recognize you as a trainer and obey your every command without question. I also want you to have this TM. TM24! Bam! That contains Dragon Breath. No, it doesn't have anything to do with my breath. Breath. <laughs> if you don't want it, you don't have to take it. So you've collected all the badges. Your destination is the Pokemon League in Indigo Plateau. Do you know how to get there? From here, go to Newbark Town. Then surf east. The route there is very tough. Don't you dare lose at the Pokemon League. If you do, I'll feel even worse about having lost you. You should feel bad. But, um, yeah. So, guys, I guess we're gonna go right now back home to where else? Newbark Town. Oh, and also, something... Professor Elm. Hello, Silver? I have something here for you. Could you swing by my lab? See you later. Yes, sir, Professor Elm, sir. Heidi. So, we're gonna go fly... Using Star Marine. Oh. I just realized, there's no PC there. Alright, so first we gotta go to Cherry Grove. I'm gonna go pick up Lapras, and I'll be right back. Yo guys, I'm here. I, I decided to forget about Lapras, because we're not going to need him um, on this trip. So, going here. Professor Elms. Never thought we'd come back here, but anyway. Professor Elm, what's up? Hi, Silver. Thanks to you, my research is going great. Take this as a token of my appreciation, and we get a Master Ball! Master Ball! The Master Ball is the best! It's the ultimate ball! It'll catch any Pokemon without fail. It's given only to those recognized Pokemon researchers. I think you can make better use of it than I can, Silver. Thanks, Professor Elm. Now, can I take your can I take the Chikorita, please? Uh, it's not gonna give me Chikorita. Anyway, so let's go back home and talk to Mom, who is in the kitchen making sandwiches for my arrival. Hi, welcome home. You're trying very hard, I see. I've kept your room tidy. Or is this about your money? What do you want? Um, I guess I'll get... Wow. Mommy saved a lot of money for me, guys. So I guess I'll just take all of it. For now. I mean, I'll come back and get the rest, but since we're gonna be preparing for the, um, Elite Four, I don't see why we should hold back. Anyway, coming over to my hat room. My mother bought us some stuff, so... Oh, no. I did a lot of, um, like, putting away and whatnot. So I got basically everything in here. Literally everything. So, I'm gonna get all that. I'm gonna get what we need when we get to Elite Four, but... 
I think I think it's time to end this video, but not without doing something else first. Well, they said sail east. Claire did, so let's go this way. And all right, guys, and we land. And this guy, what? Hey, do you know what you just did? You're taking your first step into Kanto. Check your Poke Gear map and check. I shall. Holy crap, we're in Kanto. Anyway, guys, now that we've reached Kanto, this is our. We've taken the first step into the Pokemon League. And in the next episode, we'll get there. Or at least make progress to there. But, um, till then, peace out.